you too. What's up, it's your boy 360 Jeezy. I'm gonna do something different in this intro. You guys already know what the cut is. You see the thumbnail, okay? But to all my students out there, you're watching me in class and there's always different type of students. You know what I mean? There's different type of personalities and there's different type of, you know, what, what barber students do. And I'm gonna touch on it in every intro. If you're, if you're the barber, okay, that shows up late all the time and always, always giving excuses on why you showed up late or I didn't do this because I didn't you know I needed to do this and this is why I'm this and this is why I did this and this is why I'm I I couldn't make it in and this is why I couldn't turn into my listen listen stop with the excuses all right if there's any instructor in this class that 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 feels what I'm talking about all right I just want you to bust that person out and say you know what meet me in my office and then write them up because you know it, it, needs, it needs to stop okay all right and I'm not one to be a snitch Okay, I'm, I'm not a snitch. Write them up. Write them up. Write them up. Write them up. Because you know it, it needs it needs to stop. Okay, I'm not a snitch or anything. Even though I told you to tell y'all to tell them to tell them to rich you out. I'm not a snitch. I'm just saying. All right, some of y'all need to get checked. All right, it's your boy 360 GZ. Stay tuned to this educational video, and I hope you showed up on time for this. Oh, how about that? All right. Okay. All right, instructor, please don't don't laugh at this, man. You're supposed to set an example. It's your boy 360 Jeezy, stay tuned. <laughs>
and it's tough to say that word but I'm adding another transition basically balding out the bottom even more bald than you know the clippers basically this adds another transition to your blend which makes everything look way more cleaner Now with the lever open, I'm using my Oster's speed lines. I'm going up about an inch and I'm making sure that everything is real neat. Now with the one guard open, same thing, going up about an inch, making sure everything is neat. Sometimes you will have to flick out to get um, the bulk out of the way, but majority of it is just setting in that guy line. Right here, I got my two guard open, and this right here is a little tricky. I'm actually using my comb, and I'm stopping my comb uh, in, in about an inch of where I want to set in my guideline. So what I'm doing is I'm dragging my comb down, and I'm running my clippers up. That way, it stops me from taking off more hair than I want. It stops the hair from actually moving also, so that's the reason why I'm uh, I, I'm grabbing my comb and I'm running the clipper up. I'm gonna drop back down to my one guard close and soften that middle line. Again, this is not gonna take out the middle line, you guys. This is basically making it easier for you to come behind it with the next guard. With the zero guard closed, it's time to flick out that middle line. Flicking out is what you see right here. It's just, it's a different motion than setting in the guy line. It's kind of, you know, uh, going to the head and flicking out. Now with the lever closed, in a flick out motion, flick out the bottom line. Keep in mind when you're trying to use the flick out motion, taking out that bottom line, that you wanna use your corners of your blade. Don't use the full blade because you can take off more than you wanna chew, you know what I mean? Uh, when you use the full blade, um, certain areas can go higher if you're not really paying attention so most of the time when I'm doing my bottom line I use my corners um, to flick out so just keep that in mind it's not all about using the full blade 
just like you know if you want to get it done faster or whatever is the reason why you're using the full blade but the corners work perfect for trying to knock out that bottom line Right now, I'm using my clipper over comb technique using my wall magic clips. These wall magic clips are uh, modified. They're balding clippers, so it makes it easier for my hands to be cord for, for my clippers to be cordless and just go around the head like I need to. Um, right now, I'm kind of taking off the bulk at the top, making everything flow like it should. Right now I'm gonna saturate the hair with water just to make sure everything is damp so I can get into my shear work. For those that don't know, um, I'm saturating the hair with water because when the hair is wet, it stretches to its maximum potential. Right now, I'm sectioning off the hair, separating the bangs from the back. For those that want good prices on shears, um, you could go to Cut Like a Boss on Instagram. They have great prices on shears. And yeah, I'm gonna get into it. I'm gonna do this basic comb over technique. And what I'm gonna be doing is I'm gonna cut off an inch a half inch off the top and uh, use that as a traveling guide to, to cut the rest. I'm going to just be quiet and let you guys take a look at what I'm doing. Right now I'm going to be putting some Johnny B product uh, in my client's hair. This product is called Dope. It's similar to Layrite. Um, it gives great hold and uh, you, you can basically mold the hair into the shape that you want it by putting this product in. Right now I'm going to be using my styling brush and my blow dryer basically to style in the direction that I want the hair to go in.
YouTube. This is the before my client actually got a haircut. He came in the shop looking like this, but I changed his life. Can I get a drum roll, please? YouTube, this is the cut. And if you like it, please give it a thumbs up. If you're new to my channel, hit that subscribe button all right it goes a long way all right if there's anything that you thought that i could do better in the comment section below please let me know all right i always take constructive criticism very well i'm always a barber that wants to get better and better and better so make sure in the comment section below you tell me what i can do to improve but it's your boy 360 jeezy and i'm out of here cheers